Okay, and here we are. I don't imagine they're going to let me through winningly, are they? What are your wounds? Need to talk to Patricia Vagelbud. You think any bum off the street can... Her life's in danger. Let me in or have her blood on your hands. If you thought this up, and I'll let you in, I'll throw my ass out the door. Always thought a guard was supposed to protect his charge, not his ass. So be it. I'll take you to Lady Vagel, bud. Just no trickery. Understand it? Holy crap, we walked through the door. <laughs> we have some new form of superpower. Yes, good fellow? If it's work you seek. Don't know that I'm all that good. Name's Geralt. Looking for Patricia Vagelbud. Her life's in danger. In danger? Come now. I saw Mother this morning. She seemed sad, true, but in perfect health. I'm hunting a serial killer, and I've got reason to believe your mother will be his next victim. Why, even if it's true, our guards... Are He's exceptionally cruel when he kills. Tortures his victims, cuts out their hearts. So let's see how she is, just in case. I find this all very hard to believe, but you appear to be quite serious. Please, follow me. A fire fit for Bellatane, except it's the wrong time of year. I mentioned Mother seemed sad. Do you remember? In fact, she's in the midst of a crisis of faith. A rather serious one. We'd been to Novigrad. Mother had seen the pyres in Hierarch Square. Uttered not a word on our way home. She had all the holy books in Signa's reliquaries gathered, taken outside and burnt. Then she locked herself in her room. We need to hurry. So they burnt someone she liked or knew. Hear that? Calm and quiet. All seems to be in order. We should go in, just to be sure. You're relentless, aren't you? Fine. But wait here, please. Mother's certainly not in the mood for guests. Oh! Surprise, surprise. He... he ran out the other door! Catch him! Who? Oh. Come on, guard. No time for... I have no time for dogs. Spread out! Murderer's still here! What the hell? I'm trying to help you people. Ah, uh, every time. What happened? Halt! For I put a bolt between your eyes! Listen, you got the wrong guy. Save your trickery, taking you to the heiress. <sighs> well, killer's already escaped. Lead the way, hero. We got him, Lady Ingrid. Wasn't easy, but... Lower that crossbow before you hurt yourself. This man is innocent. Thank you. Forgive me. I saw him running. Thought it was the killer fleeing. I was chasing him, and I'd have caught him if you hadn't gotten in my way. Out of my sight, at once. Mother, why did he do this to her? Why? No, <laughs> I must have got on board with walls and beggars. Yeah, because she, there's no point lying to her. Because she blasphemed the eternal fire, only thing that ties her to the other victims. Ingrid, I know this is a hard time for you, but usually the killer leaves a note on the body, a note indicating his next victim. May I? 
Very well. But you should be on your own. I do not wish to see her in this state. I do not wish to remember her like that. And let her be the last victim. Please. Bruises, broken fingernails. She defended herself. Must be why it took him longer, and why he almost got caught. Here it is. Sweet Nettie, crippled Kate's. Growing bolder, not just the name, but the place too. Won't get away this time. Tracks just end, as if he vanished. Is it Doppler? Maybe? Same wounds as the previous victims. Examination would be a waste of time. Gotta get to crippled Kate's, fast. Oh, stupid guards. How the fuck did he get past the guards? That's what I wanna know. <laughs> Because he ran right through, and none of the guards saw him. <laughs> hmm. There you go. Where are we going? Aha. Back to the city. So be it. And here we are. Well, well, another freak. In here? Nope. Ah! Sweet Nettie, where is she? Upstairs. But she's with a very important client. Oh, I'm Do sure not she disturb is. Them. <laughs> you mean me to grab another lass to join us? No, I was thinking the ass two and you. Discounts, no credit. No one will hear you, bitch. Not a soul. You, though, whole town will hear you in a minute. Yet again, you disturbed me. And I so dislike being disturbed. I was to play with sweet Nettie, render her not so sweet, but I shall see to you first. First, gotta tell me why you do it. For pleasure. Satisfaction. <laughs> Achievable with whores in a lot of ways. Many traditional. Doesn't take killing them, trust me. Who said anything about killing? I could stop at a few burns. Third degree, but still. Mm, this rosy skin will roast quite well. Uh, why am I talking to this prick? Just kill him. Just can't listen to any more of this shit. No one's forcing you to, mutant. You honestly think you can kill me, boy? You're free now. Oh, thank you. Thank you. If not for you. I did everything, and I said, for the right price, of course. And then he smiled. Oh, God, it came with shivers. And then he hit me. So hard I passed out. I was bound when I came to. And he was here in the poker, in the fire. I get it, love. Calm, Calm down. down. He won't hurt you anymore. He won't hurt anyone. Poker's a relic.
Well, that's that done. With the option to question him, I imagine I should have probably questioned him more. He might have let something slip. Like if he was hired by somebody to do it. How the fuck do you get out of this room? Through that room again? Yeah, through there. Okay. No, I probably should have questioned him. He might have let something slip, but... I just kind of wanted to kill him before he does something stupid like kill the bitch. Stop tittle tattling and get to work. I mean, he's a vigilante. Only kills Won't find any better. From the Yoruga to the Dragon Mountains. Don't know what to believe anymore. Where'd you hear this? It's a material world, and I'm a material girl. Wanna bite me, Wolfie? No, I wanna leave, love. And then we go back. They say some witches spy for the black ones. Don't look at me, I'm not dressed in this clothes for any other reason than style. Wars. Wars everywhere. La 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 la. Better, right? Y yes. Did you take care of what I asked? Yeah. The witch's way. Thank you, Geralt. For me and Priscilla. Yeah. Did my part. Your turn now. Take care of her. Good care. I will. You'll see. Treat her better than the Dryads of Broccolon could. She's talking again. Nice surprise. Isn't it? Professor Von Gratz told me her wounds are healing faster than a troll's. Not the most flattering comparison, but encouraging. Maybe... She might even sing again someday. For now, we'll try performing as a duo. She'll play the lute, I'll sing. Dandelion and Kalanetta. Got a nice ring to it, doesn't it? Sounds great. Good luck, Dandelion. On stage and off. Hmm. I said I probably should have pried more into the guy's, uh... Well, it might have been like a puppet master, but to the little weirdness, or it... But I couldn't stand to sit and they'll fucking let him talk, so... Yes, Geralt? Either way, fuck him. He's dead now. Know another surgeon from Oxenford Academy. Her name's Shani. Know her? Red hair cropped short, freckles. And a hopeless idealist. Naturally, I know her. She was my assistant for a year. Any idea where she is now? My gut tells me she's somewhere along the front, patching up pikemen. I told her it would be futile. In the time she saved a hundred lives, another thousand would be lost. But medics with a mission, you can't argue with them. Found and killed the murderer. It was Nathaniel. Caught him red-handed at Kate's. He was just about to cut into his next victim. Innkeeper wanted to keep me out. Important customer, he said. I thought nothing could surprise me in Novigrad. Seems I was wrong. Deeply wrong. Hmm. Thank you, Geralt. Were it not for you, this would never have ceased. Farewell. Well, that's that quest done. Moving on. Well, this guard's beating the crap out of these dudes. <laughs> There he goes. 
Alright, moving on. We're going to Skillia. I can't bother doing all these side quests right now. We'll come back to them later, likely. The interesting ones, but uh, we'll continue on with the main story and uh, go from there. Okay, let's uh, find ourselves a ship. To Skillia, shall we? Who's captain of this ship? Looking at her. I, her. That's right. I, a woman, am captain. Shocking as shit, I know. Well, that attitude, not really love. <laughs> Need to get to Skellige. Not on this boat, you won't. Pay you well. The islanders live off plunder in the seas. Not willing to risk that. Ever sailed there? Listen, the islanders attack all ships. When they hate someone, Nilfgaard, for instance, they attack him more. But truth be told, not much more. Boarded me once. Expect they wanted to see if I had captain's bollocks. That spot of fun gave me enough Skelliger for a lifetime. All right, I'll take a hint, love. I'll go elsewhere. Lovely British weather. Well, it's a miracle you came back at all. Oh, oh. oh. pirates. You captain of this tub? What's it to you? I'm Skellige bound. Need to get there. Start swimming. Islanders, the black ones, all attackers in those waters. No one sails the route these days. Come on. Clans are ready to deal. Leave you alone if you do. Someone's done it. Gotta have. Not likely. Except maybe that daft bastard Wolverston from the Atropos. A liar, a thief, and a bugger, that one. He might have parlayed with the sea swine. Hmm. Where can I find him? In a pigsty most times. Others, the Golden Sturgeon. Ask for Flask. Everyone knows him. Cowards, all of you. Seriously, lovely British weather. Ah, oh, drenched again. Wolverston, captain of the Atropos. So you want to know if I'm Atropos, captain of the Wolverston? No fucking clue, mate. <laughs> I need to get to Skellige. My Atropos and me, we're due to sail for our Skellig. Carrying grain. But that's our shush. Got any coin? Thousand? Gotta get more coin. You sure do. For I won't even whip me horse in a bath without payment in advance. Non-human, are you? Look for well, your kind beyond you. the walls. You'll squirt your kidneys! Ha! I mean, I have a thousand. I can very easily sell some stuff to get that money back. I, can, I probably have like 20,000 worth of crap from uh, crafting materials that I haven't sold. But uh, I don't exactly relish giving a thousand grand to the drunken captain who may not even be the captain. You're back. Fine. Here. That enough? Mm. Hefty sack. Like a bull's. When do we sail? Not sure you're ready. You can barely stand. Know this, stranger. Captain Wolverston never sails sober. The sea goes one way, Wolverston the other. Makes the rock unbearable. <laughs> so, ready to set sail? 
Sure. Let's go. As long as you get uh, me there, I won't have to kill you to get the money back. We must drink to the wind, to good fortune, and to the strength of my Atropos. I bet it's like some shitty little sailing boat. <laughs> Hank us away. Okay, it is an actual ship. <laughs> I don't know, but if I was Garrod, I'd sleep with my sword. Just saying. Like, hugging it. Yes. <laughs> Not having any douchebag walk into my room and grab the fucking thing. Although he's a witcher, I imagine they hear him coming miles away. Great. Time for some killing. I said that, Duckard? I don't know. <laughs> I meant to say Dark or Garrow or something, and it was sort of combined into one word. At least I didn't lose my swords. I'm not afraid of dying. Afraid. Speak of English. See, I've landed on Ord Skellig. How you figure that? You're wearing clan on crate colors. Ord Skellig's their island. On the Atropos, were you? Yeah. Thought the captain had a deal with you. With us? Meaning who exactly? Might have arranged something with Lugos, but crack? Nay. Clearly should have, though. Outlander ships aren't welcome in these waters. What about you? What do you seek in Skellige, eh? Agreed to meet a sorceress here. Yennefer of Vengerberg. She's supposed to be on Ord Skellig. There's a witch at Kertrolda. Croc's guest. Could be the one you're meeting. That scorn I hear in your voice. You've good ears. Folks say this witch has got Croc wrapped around her finger. Orders everyone about. Word is she's vicious at it, but a hag's a hag. Seen her? Know what the sorceress looks like? Aye. Where's black and white? If not for her tits, you'd think she was a beached orca. Fact is, even those who see her for a wench should gladly push her out to sea, tits and all. 
<laughs> I'm going to slap you. <laughs> What's your name? Stangrim. Well, Stangrim, I don't like you. In fact, I feel like slapping you. Go ahead, Drifter. You try. Look for mercy! Had enough? Best finish me now. Cause you'll be fucked once I catch my breath. Uh-huh. It was a good fight. That's enough for now. It was an ass whooping you out. Stop being generous. Wait to care, Trolda. I expect I'll find it. Head north. Then turn west towards the bay before you come to the bridge. You'll find the Jarl port site today. Your sorceress ought to be there too. Thanks. So long. Now, I want my fucking gold back. Give me back my gold. Medallion's humming. Place of power. It's gotta be. I'll take this, and then I want my fucking gold. At least I'm looting the fucking shit to get my gold back. <laughs> yeah, please loot the stuff when I tell you to loot the stuff, would you? Siren Den. Gotta ruin it for them. Hello. She's pissed. <laughs> Bitch lost a wing. At least all my gold's in this fucking chest. Free gold. <laughs> There's the wing that I fucking tossed off the side of the ship. Come on, you have to be able to get that grand back, right, from the shipwreck. Come on, girl, stop being retarded. I don't think I'm getting that money back. Would have been nice, but I don't see it happening. There's something I can do up there, though. I was kind of hoping it would be in that chest, but... Flawless diamond. I can probably make most of my cash back from all this loot that I'm getting off the ship alone, so...
I don't know, some, there are still some bodies and chests about, I might get lucky. All this ore and stuff is uh, likely paid back what I've lost. Although there's even more shit over here, so. Hmm. I'll loot the rest of this and record it if I happen to find the money. 